now to the coronavirus pandemic here in California. Governor Gavin Newsom not ruling out the possibility of reinstating a statewide mask mandate. This comes as the infectious Delta variant is spreading. COVID-19 cases rising in California, and some counties have been taking the issue into their own hands. 17's Ashley Zavala shows you how COVID rules could impact the governor's recall election. A growing number of counties across the state are starting to take matters into their own hands, either encouraging or requiring mask use indoors, regardless of your vaccination status. But Governor Gavin Newsom is not yet ready to say whether that statewide mask mandate will return. Well, we'll, we'll see. Look, at the end of the day, the epidemiology, the spread, the variants make that determination. Governor right? Gavin Newsom responding to questions about the possibility his administration will bring back a statewide mask mandate. State data show as of Tuesday, 61% of the state's population is vaccinated. Newsom noting that's not the case for all of California. He spoke inside of a school in Tulare County where the vaccination rate is below the state average. We don't have to have masking if we all got vaccinated. COVID-19 cases, the positivity rate and hospitalizations continue to climb in California as state officials say the Delta variant accounts for already 60% of the cases sequenced in July. The governor would not say if there's a certain data point or threshold state leaders are waiting to reach before reinstating restrictions. I think we will get through this. Um, I'm not, we're not looking to do any physical distancing, any social distancing. We're not looking to close anything down. As the governor faces a recall election in September, fueled in part by his past pandemic-related policies, experts say the decision will have consequences. It's a very slender tightrope that he's walking. Democratic strategist Stephen Maviglio was press secretary for the only other governor to face a recall election in the state, Gray Davis. He says on one hand, a mask requirement will irritate a large number of voters, but on the other hand, doing nothing could frustrate those who think more protection is needed. His worst case scenario is having a lot of medical professionals holding press conference saying we need this mandate. You know, he has always been seen nationwide as on the cutting edge of basing data on science and, and actually taking the advice of those medical professionals. And if he doesn't, that puts him in a very awkward spot and one he certainly doesn't want to be in during the next few weeks. For now, the California Department of Public Health says it will continue to support those counties who decide to have stricter COVID-19 protocols in place. At the state capitol, Ashley Zavala, 17 News.